Hello everybody and welcome back to The Witcher. Alright, I guess it's time to, well, torture Regis a little bit. And before we begin, uh, make sure you grab everything in this uh, area. Uh, because you won't be able to come back here after this quest uh, has ended, after we leave. And uh, also I did some... Uh, well, research on this and it's a good thing I did because I took a look at the quest and well there's something that you can easily miss and uh, not uh, connected to the armor or anything in this uh, dungeon uh, all right first let's uh, do the thing we Regis and then we'll see what you can easily miss uh, if I think I've uh, examined all of these symbols, so don't have to do it again. Ages for mentioned one vampire being kept here. Yes, well, you see, humanitarians is something my ancestors were not. They concluded Kagmar would best be punished if he were tormented with the scent of blood he could not taste. Thus, they also kept humans here, humans whose blood they slowly let. Kagmar ranted and raged in pain as those those humans slowly bled to death. They treated them like livestock, live bait. I'd like to be able to turn back time, deny it, but alas, I can do neither. Feel shame for my brethren, but it's all I can do. Don't take it so hard. Nothing you could have done about it. Let's get to work. Well, that was awkward. Fine. I prepared the bait. Please be so kind and place it, ideally at the tunnel entrances. The scent will spread most effectively then. Place the bait at the tunnel entrances. Monsters will catch its scent more quickly. When I think how these tunnels got here, the scent shivers. It was the natural order of things. The place reeked of death and it attracted necrophages. Okay, why'd you turn to smoke? Where are you going? Oh, you're lighting. Nice. Thank you. Uh, Alright. Got some red stuff. We have to place the bait. This will hold. Doesn't look like anything special. I told you. Kagmar thrashed about inside it for over two centuries. Appearances can be deceiving. Okay, we have four pieces of bait and four places to put it. And examine this, so throw it away. Okay, that's one piece. Come on, let me put it. Three done, one left. Think this'll work? I certainly hope so. The meat stench is so thick, I wager it carries clear to no Uh, what? From what I remember, I think we're in for a pretty tough fight. So, better remember to take some potions at the beginning. Okay, let's place the last one. Set. What now? I shall enter the cage. You must chain me inside. The bars are made of an alloy that will prevent me from transforming into mist. Kinda thought you wouldn't want to. 
I shall be in great pain. My sole thought being to stop that pain. I cannot know what I will do. We must hurry. The beasts have caught the scent also my head. I started spinning. That the blood? Uh, someone who's never experienced a vampire's bloodlust does not know the true meaning of thirst. Something you'll say when you can't take it anymore. And what would you do once I uttered it? Don't know. Uh, calm you down. Somehow. Please, girl. You won't be able to. We must forge through this. That is all. And not sure about poison. Should I get a kidnap as well? Yeah, just in case. Okay, so that can happen. Gotta be careful. Bait set. What now? Maybe we need a safe word. You know, something you'll say when you can't take it anymore. And what did you do once I uttered it? Don't know. Calm me down. Someone. Please, girl. You were. Mm -hmm. We just have smelled the blood. No! <laughs> few hours. Scent won't bother you anymore. Get you out of here. I 
mansion in this state. Tell me how. I'll help you. Any better? Far from ideal. And some time must pass before I fully recover. But yes, a bit better. Thank you. Never expected it to be like that. You didn't tell me. We need not discuss it. But we do. Because if I'd known you were going to subject yourself to torture... What would you have done? Found dead laugh some other way. I did not wish you to use any other way. Did that occur to you? No. Because I thought no being would ever willingly subject itself to that kind of pain. You vampires aren't any different from us in that regard. I told you. The pain is my way of paying my debt. The enormous debt I owe Detlaf. If I had to do it again, I would in a heartbeat. Resonance, it's ready. Are you certain you followed the formula? The proportions were exact, the brewing time precise. This is important, Geralt. The slightest deviation could cost even a witcher dearly. Relax. Got some experience brewing potions. Very well. In that case, let's begin. Excuse me. I shall only take a moment. You jump the queue, sir. But Count, sir, you must understand. I've a meeting. The Count... Sir, you were next. Please, take a seat. This gentleman was here first. Step down or you shall regret it. Ah, <laughs> fails to realize he was your friend, Count. It was then I ordered him to give up his seat and step off the step. If only you'd seen his face. We got him good, didn't we, Detlam? And then Mother insisted we buy the mill. <laughs> Curious, eh? At least I've a yarn to spin for friends and associates. Forgive me. What? Awake at last. You ride like a squirrel caught in a snare. 
I'd begun to fear they were death throes, that you'd departed. <clears throat> uh, uh, sure wasn't pleasant, but it worked. What did you see? Delacroix. His death did not come easy. Seems Dedlaff had made friends with him, still killed him, chopped up his corpse, and he was overcome with fury, remorse, cut off the hand that had committed the murder. Hmm, interesting. And entirely unlike the Detlef I know. See anything else? Saw a moment. Delacroix did something selfless, was kind to Detlaf. Guess it could have been the start of their friendship. Why the uncertainty? Nothing extraordinary about it. Normal, everyday situation, really. Visions were supposed to issue from strong emotions. Clearly, the situation provoked such emotions in Detlaf. Keep in mind, he did later murder Delacroix. Killing someone who's grown dear to us, it's bound to elicit strong emotion. Vampires are no different in that regard. Did you see anything else? There was something. Showed up twice in the vision. A boot black stand. Dedlaw first met Delacroix there. Went back after the murder, actually. Peculiar. Stand was somewhere in the port district. And the boot black acted as if he knew Dedlaw. Hmm. That would be even odder. Perhaps we should have a chat with the lad. Though I would expect no breakthroughs. It's our only lead. I'll go talk to him. Coming with. I shall join you later if it's no trouble. I don't yet feel strong enough to venture out. That's fair. Rest up. Be back as soon as I learn anything. Okay, quest complete. Can I talk to Regis? Not now, Geralt. I cannot move a step without your assistance. Okay, uh, let's see. We have to go over there. Uh, there's another secondary quest from uh, uh, the lady we saved. But... Where is it? Is it this? No. Which one was it? I think it's this over here. So let's go there. And I'll show you what you can easily miss. As you can see, it uh, tells us to go talk to the boot, boot black. But there was a second place in the vision. I think it's over here, if I'm not mistaken. And that is the place that Detlaf killed him. Come on, Roach. Oh, you spawned in a weird place again. Come on. That's it, Roach. Okay, I think this is the place. I'm supposed to find some people talking or something like that. And that should start the quest. Oh, I think that's them. And we have a fast travel here. I don't think I've ever been to this place before. That's locked. 
Nothing wrong back, so only inside. Pathetic. Everybody had torches. Okay, uh, let's see what do we got in this area. We got something over here. Okay, he threw the body from up there and ended up over here. So the current goes something like this. Maybe. Can't really tell. Okay, let's see what we find. out to sell the mill and adjoining lands also here's the quest footprints lead upstairs no peasants boots made these Oh yeah, uh, you have to do this uh, before oh, no, that. Uh, this one. If you go, you start this one, this is gonna be lost. So be sure to do it before that. Okay, anything else? I don't know. Or just the same one. This should be the last thing. Blood. Lots of it. Not all human either. So this is where Dedloff lost his hand. And where he quartered Delacroix. Definitely the scene of the crime. Not likely to learn much else here though. Alright. Oh, nice chunk of experience. So yeah. Easily missable quest. And I have a festival here. Uh, let me take a look. Do we get anything special? I don't think so. Alright, let's go over here because this one hasn't appeared yet. Or do I have to actually go talk to her for it to start? I don't remember. The Duchess, oh, monsters like your any mine. 
Okay, she's still eating. I, th I think she has to stop eating before we can interact with her. And if you don't know, you basically hire her as a cook. I think that's the result of the, that little quest you can get from her. Alright, let's go over here. Although I don't think I'm gonna start it. Might take a while to complete. Okay. Uh, got a few minutes. Let's see how much we can do. Oh, what's this? I don't know what that's about. There was, a time was hidden over there. Drive off that sort of oh, chest. That is a chest, right? Okay, now I don't want to start it anymore. Oh, let's do it. I can go a little longer if needed. So how would you explain it? Whether it pours for a week or the sun bakes our pates, we've always mud up to our ankles here. You can't blame me for Beauclair's fickle weather. Fickle weather? I've seen you. You empty your chamber pot in front of our shop each morning, so folks will dirty their boots, go to you to get them cleaned. A far-fetched conspiracy theory, sirs. I'll conspire to welt your bum with my belt. Come here. Leave him alone. Just who the spit are you? Well, I am a witcher. I'm definitely not his father. And I don't like this one. A witcher. And I'd advise you to go back where you came from. I thought witches defend men from monsters, not cheats from justice. Need to talk to the boy. You can chat to him all you like, after we tan his hide. So stand down. Not gonna happen. Won't it? Well, then we'll thrash you as well. Which is all the same to me. Let's charge! Uh, take him for a ride! What's the meaning of this? The brawl? Who started it? I'm investigating the beast, on the Duchess's orders. Ah, yes. We've heard of you. And these men. What are they doing? And let's not be an arse. Nothing really. Had a little misunderstanding. Figured it out though. Uh-huh. I see. As the Duchess's protege, you may go. But this lord, that's another matter. You'll come with us. Some time in a cell ought to scare the dimwits out of you. Come on. You're very good with your fists, sir. Wouldn't be looking for work, would you? We'd make a fine duo. Yeah? How you imagine that working? Splendidly. That's how. I suggest a partnership, where I see to the boots while you stand guard. And as you're the stronger, come morning you'd take the chamber pot out and help me make mud. 
bit about the Muds true, they were right to want to box your ears. I've got to make a living somehow, so what say you, sir? Partners? Let me think about it. Listen, I'm interested in a certain gentleman. Oh, wait, wait! Before we get to talking, please, take a seat. But my boots are clean. In this city, no boots are clean unless they just come off my stamp. A seat, sir, please. So then, who was it you wanted to ask about? One of your patrons. Tall, elegant black frock, not from around here. An arrival? Hmm, indeed. I hear a faint bell ringing. A modest sum might make it sing out loud and clear. How much? Let's say... 500 crowns. What? Gotta be kidding me. What would you even do with that kind of coin? Expand my venture. I'm sure you can imagine. Have a proper stand with a big sign. I want a new box too. New polishes, new brushes. And if I've enough coin left, I'll buy a share in a launderer's. Get wastewater for free. Hmm. <laughs> Got it all planned out. I should think so. Capital is all I require. Okay, I'm not gonna... And what's that sign? X, see the kid? Alright. Let's see if we can't figure something out. Also, I think... If I remember correctly, if you give him the entire sum without uh, going down at all, uh, it will count as proof of uh, charity, was it? I think that's the one. For the quest, there can only be one. So... I'm just gonna give him the 500. I have plenty of money. Ah, see? I knew we'd clinch it. Guess I can agree to that. A thousand thanks. I shan't forget it. Now to the matter at hand. I know the fellow you seek, though I don't know his name. A steady patron. Gets his boots cleaned every few days. He's very good to me. Always pays me a premium. Know where I might find him? No, but you could wait here. Perhaps he'll stop by. Don't have the time for that. Sure you don't know where to find him? Or maybe notice which direction he came from? When I clean boots, sir, I do not look up to see where folk come from. I clean. It seems you're having a rough go of it. Oh, you're here. Feeling better? I am, thank you. The local necropolis. The air does wonders for me. Now... If I might intercede, I dare say I've the right question to ask. Young man, you see this vial? One drop added to your boot polish will help you wipe even the most encrusted boot clean as the dome of St. Lebioda's Cathedral. With it, you will serve three times as many patrons at a fraction of the effort, and piles more coin. I'm prepared to give you this vial if you tell me where the man we seek lives. Uh, but you won't hurt him, will you? The gentleman's art, true, but he's kind. In point of fact, he's a friend. Yet we had a falling out of sorts and would like to straighten matters out. I leave his boots at the door of a house near the port. The door is red. But I do not know if the gentleman lives there. Worth checking. Might happen on a lead. Would you let me scrape the dirt off your kickers before you go? With all due respect, sirs, your boots could stand a cleaning. Thank you. Perhaps later. Handled that kid pretty well. Finding the right approach. That's the trick to dealing with children. Mm, yeah, saw that. Meaning, the right thing to bribe them with. All right, where is this place? Red door. One the boot black mentioned. Okay, the... What is... Ravens are kind of a dead giveaway. But with that being said... I'm gonna end this one here, guys. I kind of went long enough. 
So uh, next time we're gonna open the door and see what's inside. But in the meantime, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to do some of that uh, YouTube stuff. You know, like, comment, subscribe, maybe even share. And until next time, take care.